If you came for Jumu'ah, Friday, and every Friday you made one promise to Allah to do something good or to stop something bad, you would become a much, much better Muslim. And you would be proud of your own self and your own achievement. But the problem is, we come to the masjid. As we are leaving, we forget. We even forget what the Imam said. And we are busy with something else. And we are busy doing something. And as we exit, we are talking to each other about this deal or that person or where we are going to eat and so on. My brothers, my sisters, don't underestimate the favor of Allah upon you. When a person gets used to sinning, it's a sign that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is not pleased with that person. But when Allah gives you the acceptance and grants you the energy to come towards him, it's a sign of the love of Allah. Did you fulfill your salah today, the five daily salah? If you have not, you have work to do. And if you have, thank Allah, it's a sign of the love of Allah. Work on other things more and more. Because life is such that from the beginning to the end, you will be working on yourself. Right at the beginning, someone is working on you. Your parents, your teachers. And as you grow older, you have to work on yourself. Development of your relation with Allah, your character, your conduct and so on. But if you were to continue in those sins, like I said, you get used to it. And it, it actually takes you away from fulfilling the duties unto Allah. You become lazy to pray because you are involved in sin. When you are praying, you want to rush. You don't have the sweetness of prayer because the sweetness of ibadah is taken away from the one who's constantly sinning and they are not seeking the forgiveness of Allah. If you seek the forgiveness of Allah, good news, but we are talking about those who don't want to turn to Allah. They don't even think that I need to turn back to Allah. I need to change myself. The thought itself is a blessed thought. Follow it up with action. Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. He used to seek the forgiveness of Allah between 70 and 100 times a day. I am his follower. You are his follower. How many times are you seeking the forgiveness of Allah? How many times am I seeking the forgiveness of Allah? On a daily basis. Just like when a person is drowning in sin and doesn't want to turn to Allah, just like it makes them far from other acts of worship, the minute you turn to Allah, He will bring you closer to goodness. You find it is easy for you to dress in the correct way because you are conscious of Allah. You quit your sins. But when you are involved so, so much in some things, you won't feel the importance of other things. You won't feel the need to stop from other things because you are already involved in something and you don't even have the relation with Allah the way it should be.